Welcome to my golden games. I've finally done it. I finally went out and got a new pair of headphones So I've had these old headphones for probably almost five years now And over the last year or so they've been getting worse and worse. Uh, give me one second Here they are as you can see uh, this earpiece is a little uh, broken. Uh, I've taped it. I've glued it and yeah, it It's still just really messed up this side is fine surprisingly, but this side as you can see it's uh you, you try to fix it and it just kind of sticks right back out. So I've got new headphones. Let's uh, turn around and take a look at them. Here's the new headphones. They're Audio Technica. They're the MSR7NC. They're high res audio. Uh, so basically, my old headphones were, let's uh, grab them here. They were Turtle Beach XP 500s. These things were like three, four hundred dollars, maybe more, uh, back when I got them. And these things have lasted a long time. But I finally got new headphones. Now, I was thinking about getting the Astros A50s. But um, after, you know, some research, I figured I'd go with these. They're a really well-known brand. And they're actually known for pretty well-quality built products. And I was also looking at Bose headphones as well. But I read that the Bose headphones, they're super good quality. But they don't last as long. So I went with these. We're going to see how they are. These are wired where this is basically wireless and 7.5 surround sound, where these are stereo. Uh, these are actually noise canceling as well. So I'll flip around to the back, then I'll crack this thing open in one second. High resolution headphones with active noise cancellation. So I don't know, we'll see how they are. I read the reviews, it looked like they got pretty good reviews. It's got noise cancellation. All right, let's open this thing up. Let's flip it around there and uh, let's switch hands really quick. And let's uh, get in there a little bit and cut that a little bit. It's a little hard to do with one hand. You guys probably know that. Uh, but let's get it open there. And that should be just about good enough. There we go. So hopefully that's good. Oop, I ripped it a little bit. That's fine. Now let's open this up. that out of the way right there so it looks like it opens up just like that and getting a little in the way okay so there's this box and then that cloth so this box opens up just like that uh, so we'll uh, dump that out in a minute it's all the accessories the power cable and then we got it looks like a uh, Kind of like a cleaning cloth, just a little cloth in between it, I guess. I don't know if you'd really call that a cleaning cloth. And here they are. Now I tested them out in the store. I went to Fry's Electronics and bought them there. I was thinking about getting the headphones that, that Jacksepticeye has, but um, they were like an extra hundred dollars almost. And I kind of just wanted to get these now. And if I need to in the future, I could always upgrade to those. But let's uh, test these out and see how they look. Let's put them on. Now, these actually smell like leather. I'm not sure if it's supposed to be leather or something else. It looks like leather. Uh, I should probably look into that. I was looking at quite a few today, so I don't quite remember what exactly the earphones are made of, but it smells like leather. All right, let's put them on. All right, they feel pretty good, actually. That's a little hard because it's noise cancellation, which technically is active noise cancellation, so it... <laughs> These headphones actually do feel really good. So let me know what you think in the comments of how they look. But overall, they feel really good. And again, they're noise cancellation, so it's a little hard to talk and hear this at the same time. They're not turned on right now, which noise cancellation, usually, at least with the Bose ones, you have to turn them on in order to use them. They do feel really well built. All right, let's uh, dump this stuff out. Come on, come out. There we go, box is empty. So we got a pretty big instruction manual. Who needs that? Uh, so it's got actually two cables. One cable with the uh, volume adjust for like a microphone that I guess it has a built-in microphone. And then let's see, this is a charging cable it looks like, I think. And another uh, aux cable, or was it 3.5 millimeter, or three and a half, what? Three and a quarter millimeter jack, whatever the heck it is. And then what is this? 
I'm not sure if this is real leather or not. It doesn't look like it. But it could be. I don't think it is real leather, actually. I think it's fake, but it looks pretty nice. So it's like a little carrying case for it, I guess. So that's pretty nice. Now I'm probably gonna use my old headphone stand for these new headphones, or I'll just rest them on top of my PC. Okay guys, so I got the headphones plugged in here. This is the charge them. And then this is the audio cable. Now I thought these were wired headphones, so I'm not 100% sure. Again, I'm gonna have to go through the instructions, I guess, to figure this out. But if you guys do wanna see uh, how to, or hold on. If you guys do wanna see a full review of these headphones, let me know down in the comments. Right now, this video is just basically an unboxing. So if you do wanna see the review, let me know in the comments below. All right guys, so I guess this is where I'm gonna leave the video. It looks like it's picking up the new headphones. So let me know what you think in the comments below. If you do wanna see the review video, let me know again in the comments below. I will try to respond to you as well. Have a great day guys and see you next time. Maybe consider subscribing if you haven't already and be sure to hit that little bell icon on the channel. That way you stay notified when the videos do go live. All right guys, take it easy. Have a great night.